Okay. there. I'm like, where did you go? issue of I'm not healing fast enough. I'm gonna focus for a minute. You are one ugly motherfucker. I will say that now, though. Shoot at me. Let me fully heal. Or, you know, just smack me with the goddamn tongue of broken shit. Knock it off. Kissing that. Kill the prince cursed into a toad. What happened? Well, I know that sound. Whatever it is, I've at least meditated for at least an hour. <laughs> Sometime later. Am I in jail? What? What's going on? Ah. He's finally come to. And he can speak human, turns out. Started thinking I'm not conversing common the whole way. Except maybe with me reflection in the piss bucket. Where... Where am I? On the Albatross. Or the Fak Bath Oil. It's their strange tongue, has it? En route to a fear. Don't remember signing on as a sailor. <laughs> oh, you didn't, mate. They dragged you aboard. Seems you killed their prince. Damn it. Don't remember a thing. Just some sewers, giant toad, and some boots. If that toad was their prince, guess I'm lucky to be alive. Depends how you look at it. Happen to know a bit of a theory. Heard them saying they come here on a mission, dispatched by their king to find their prince, lift his curse. Wager their honor that are their families five generations back. 
but they'd bring him home, safe and sound. And I killed him. Great. So, must think they can save their honor by bringing the prince's murderer back to face the king's justice. Who are you? And who might you be? Felipe Caligrand, at your service. Petty thing, professional fence. And your guide about Oxenford. One of a bit of time. Mm -hmm. And why are you here? You kill a prince too? Well, to their thinking, I had a hand in this one's death. See, I was their guide. Led them down into the sewers. But not until after you'd cut their prince's gut up. Sorry about that. Not your fault, mate. When all said and done, I could have sat on my ass in the alchemy playing Gwen. Didn't have to brag about knowing Oxenford better than my own breeches. We've been at sea long? Uh, Dunno, Riley. Not that long. Though, on the other hand... <laughs> but what's it matter, any road? Matters a lot. If they're hauling me off to hang me, I'm not in a hurry to arrive. Hey, I'm glad to be silent to a fear. I hear they got wild horses there. White with black stripes. Always wanted to see one of them. Sure they're not. What's a black zebra? horses with white stripes. Nay, hey, black horses with white stripes they got in Sanguivar. That I'm sure of. Zebras! That is the- That is a joke that's run on for fucking ever! It's a goddamn joke and it's fucking zebras. Okay. Alright. Listen, there was a young woman, a medic, red hair. They capture her too? Don't recall seeing anyone of the sort. You were alone. Good. Means she managed to flee. Hopefully made it home. You're gonna probably hear me. Trying to break out stuff. yet. It's like eight in the morning and I'm making every ounce of charm I got. Nothing doing. Might be my Aferi's, Rusty. My Aferi's non-existent. Well, we'll be at sea at least oh. a month. I'll teach you some of that time. Elkal! Orial! What's that mean? They told us to shut up. There's been a misunderstanding. Can I talk to you, Captain? Alakal Sorkan! Galavatkar u Albata again! Quiet, dog. You killed our prince, and you'll pay for that. Gileam Balar! You'd be dead already. We swore on our own. How do I say? Take me to your captain. Valth Alache or Egulath. What? Elkal. Vialth. Ah. Alache il Khalif. Elkal. Inkal aver ikel ugeherev mulvita inch aver kolayev. Translation? What just happened? What did he say? Said to sit quiet. I thought you'll hang in two weeks. And then he added something like, We'll see who's in the mood for jokes then. Why? What did I say? That you wanted his auntie's hat. That was the gist of your road. Great. Give it a rest. No point talking to that one. All you get is angry gurgles. When they puff up, you notice? Are oh, them fish? What's it they're called? Are there anyone fish? here who speaks common? Ah, there's this mercenary with him. Looks a Danian to me. He's the one recruited me to show him through the sewers. Oh, and the mage, what leads them, knows a bit. Heard him talking. But I doubt either will talk to you. Uh, that was you. Catch some short eye. Not go on flapping my tongue. Got a long voyage ahead. Sleep's not what I need. Someone I can actually communicate with. That's what I want. Greetings, Geralt. Remember me? Uh. I say I don't. Not really. Gaunter Odin. Known also as Master Mirror. We bet in White Orchard. I helped you find your Yennefer. We meet again. And it seems you need my help again. Heard and loose. I don't remember him. That is, if this slog doesn't kill you first. Heaven 
tried it yet. Hmm. Doesn't look promising. Not unlike your situation. I could try to extract you from here, you know. Because you do wish to disembark, do you not? Yeah, sure. But what on earth could you? Oh, more than you'd ever expect. I shall help you, Geralt. But before I do, I must know you return the favor. So. Right. Can't possibly get something for nothing. Indeed. When all said and done, I am a merchant. So, do you want my help? Yes. It's a deal. Once it's all over, we shall meet at midnight at the crossroads, meet the willows near the village of Yantra. Ah, and I must give you something to remember me by. What's that? A mark to show we're associates. Who are you gabbing with? With no one. Oh, never like boats. Not one bit. I heave like devils. Make me stomach churn. Oh, it'd be prime to sleep through the whole thing. <laughs> Okay. I think the uh, other dude's dead. I might be dead. By the way, White Orchard, if I have my math right on Witcher episodes, is like, we ended the story on 80, so this be 81, 82, I think. Actually, 81, 82, 83. To Ophir, get us safe. The king's reward will be generous. What about the prisoner? Before the king, we must bring him. On doing so, my honor relies. Can we just bring your king the bastard's head? Like we do with the other? The other drowned. We could do nothing. We delivered mine, this one. Apart from all else, the hell the king is sure to condemn him to. I wish to see. Oh. What kind of hell? Tarring, slaying, and watering. This is for regicide. Don't be 100% honest. So I don't remember that dude at all, by the way, because White Orchard was like 80 plus episodes ago. So at least 80 hours or so. Why are you such a spastic fuck boy? Okay. Uh, 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 
Okay, this mage dude needs to fuck off. How do I kill the mage? What the fuck? I'm just so it's optional, but I feel like I need to. I'm gonna grab my shit. Wait, hold on. Let me look at something. This might help if I look at something for a minute. Wait till I load in. Okay. Yoink. Yoink. Okay. Okay, y'all need to fucking chill. Dead. Insta kills me? Dude, fuck this mage. This mage is an asshole. Fuck that. I'm running. You know what? Y'all can escape with your. Ow! Fuck, that's hot. I'm loading in and I'm booking it. These fuckers can just sit there and die. I am gone. That little sand tornado mage can just fucking tornado his way back to wherever the fuck he needs to go. I don't care. I'm out of here. Once? Cool. I didn't know. Second, I put armor on. Third? Okay, you know what? I'm a book it because I ain't stupid to deal with it a third time. Imerte. Fuck you. I'm out of here. Oh, of course. You're going to instantly cut me off. Fuck off. I'm out of here. Stop cutting me off. Fuck you. I ain't staying here. I ain't gonna fucking suck a dick. Fuckers. 
Give me my fucking gear. Give me my goddamn fucking gear on. Oh look, you're down there still? Go fuck yourselves! Where am I currently? I am... North of Novigrad, actually. I didn't think I was north of Novigrad already, but, you know, that's cool. Uh, we're gonna do this, and, uh, we're gonna go fight Master Mirror. These fuckers can just sit here and twiddle their damn thumbs being someone in, like, a bunch of assholey maneuvers and shit. I'm running. See ya, dickheads! Uh, I want to look at the map again for a minute, because there's something over here I think I can mark. Uh, it's over here. Uh... Are you two really coming after me? Runestones, assholes. Yeah, I ain't staying here. That mage is a dick. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with that mage, but that is dumb. I'm fucking gone. Thank God it's optional. Shut up, alarm. Are these drowners over here? I swear to God, if you're a bunch of fuckers who are drowners, I'm gonna kill you. Okay. I swear to fucking Okay. No. So I see how everything is gonna be right now. And if this is an indication of New Game Plus, oh, I'm gonna have so much anger. Because I have been told. I'm gonna, I, I said this on stream even on my off to, uh, after I beat the game DLC night. Like when I'm not streaming, I'm probably gonna start playing Witcher 3 on New Game Plus again. Because I want, I, I, if there's a new game plus, I'll play those games on new game plus. Um. Now I'm one on one, bitch. Fuck off. I am out of here. That guard treasure down below. Wait, can I get to it from below the house? Uh, from the house, maybe? say right do you know oh my god this is just DLC 
DLC. Or not DLC. It's uh, another side mission. Which honestly I'm okay with. Actually. So we have without a trace. So we now have one, two, three, four, five, uh, six. Oh, wait, this is Novograd's? This is Heart and Stone Treasure Hunt. Oh, wow, I actually did not know that. I thought with it being here that it would just be, uh, what you call it, a normal game. I guess it doesn't help that everything I have is also installed at once, so, like, all these probably... Like, if I played through the game without Heart of Stone and Blood and Wine installed, honestly, it probably would have been like, oh, yeah, these areas don't actually exist. I'm like, oh... I mean, again, I also could be very wrong. I mean, I'm not saying the map parts exist. I'm talking about, like, also the location. So, like, since that gave me a treasure quest for Hearts of Stone, I didn't have Hearts of Stone anymore. There would have never been a question mark there for guarded treasure. Is what I'm sa trying to say. I am meditating. Because fuck that. Everything apparently now can fucking... Kick my ass. I need to look into getting better armor. I've had the same armor for a while. I guess it's about time we change up armor again. Possibly we're probably going to change up weapons as well soon now. Because I feel like now I'm severely underpowered and underarmored. So... I will honestly probably just start, like, changing weapons up for... Even if it's like, oh, five damage more? Yeah, I'll probably add that, because that could probably make a big difference at this point. So. Hunisuku. So, actually... Inventory. Cool. Better silver sword. Taking that. That's a minus to seven armor. Okay. So I'm gonna bring. I'm bring. What? Traveler. Hello. Come sit with us. Why? Curious place for a conversation about art. Anywhere is good for that. It's simply a matter of summoning inspiration. Vodka, for example, is a great aid. Care to drink with us? To poetry? Sure. This is a side quest, so Why I have not? a bad feeling about I'm it. A bit thirsty. And when a man is thirsty, melancholy strangles his soul. Poor Gascoigne! Gentlemen, I am so pickled, crocked, and stewed. <laughs> Want another term for your state? Don't be vulgar. What will our new friend think? Poor another. Fine. Last round for me, though. Vodka's gone, as are the troubadours, and my things. Damn it. Footprints, fresh. Let me kick some ass. Actually, curious about something. So got back up. I don't have everything, but oh, I got back up.
Know what rhymes with wicked witcher? My things, before I turn you into mincemeat. Must be a slant, right? Shut your trap and give it back. So then, we are square. Even good, yes? Oh, <laughs> I'm doing this one. Not quite. We'll be good once you give me your things. All of them? You can keep your knickers. No way. Displayed in the sideshow of the Oh, that's fucking great. Oh, and it auto put my shit back on, thank you. Quite profitable. Uh, a couple of here of the village watch out. Oh. Smile fair as spring as to water me draws you. It's tongue sharp and silvery as she implores you. He wishes he grants as he swears to adore you. Gold, silver, jewels, he lays riches before you. Jews need be repaid and he will come for you. All to reclaim. Well, I'm trying. Oh, at midnight. I knew you'd come. You a soothsayer? It matters little who I am. Your escape, I made it possible. Previously, Yennefer, you found her thanks to me, so you feel you owe me. Memento you gave me. Pretty effective reminder. That is its purpose. Incidentally, I find it quite funny how even the most rotten scoundrels have this inner compunction to repay debts of gratitude. Humans, elves, dwarves, all races, you really must explain that to me, one day. As for the here and now, tell me, how'd you manage with your theories? Well, can't say I remember you helping me that much. Storm broke out, ships smashed into some rocks. Is that what you believe? You're more a die-hard rationalist than I thought. Hmm. So it's not gratitude that's brought you here, which must mean curiosity's done the job. Hmm. I adore that trait. It gives birth to so many fascinating tales. And the tale you so clearly want to tell me? What's that about? It's about a man, worse than most. A vulgar, despicable man with a heart of stone. Hey! Name a drop. man who refuses to pay his debts. Really think this will interest me? Any reason why? He's wronged you as well. His name is Olgierd von Everick. Okay. What did he do to you? Before I reveal this, I'd like to make one thing very clear. Olgierd von Everick did willfully and maliciously conspire to cause you to kill a man who might have been cured. Had I not intervened, you would have lost your head for this. Do you know why he did it? Because he's a degenerate monster in human flesh who feeds on the pain and suffering of others. Well, you clearly don't like him. What did he do to you? He and I made a pact. A pact under which I called on my many talents and associates to give him what he desired. Right. Now the time's come to pay. Yet, he shirks his obligation. Need me to collect a debt? 
I'm not some hired muscle. Muscle is not what this requires. It needs a soul intelligent and clever. An individual who fears no dare. Someone like you. Pure flattery, that. Of course it is. After all, I am a traveling merchant. But make no mistake. I've many interesting wares on offer. Wares like? Surfeit. Abundance for the body and soul. You will lack neither food nor drink. As a Witcher, you might desire weapons supreme. I can offer you those you dreamt of. Your body, agile as never before. Your mind, faster than lightning. Romantic prowess to charm all womankind. But above all, I offer a great and true adventure. An experience like no other. The fate of only the chosen few. Sure sounds generous. And all that for my help with one small matter. Won't want anything else from me? Just one. Honesty. What about you? Call yourself a man of many talents? Can't you take care of this? Therein lies the catch. Our pact states that before I can collect my due, I must yet fulfill three wishes for Von Everick. But I cannot fulfill them myself directly. Making use instead of a... Mm, how shall I put it? A proxy. Mm -hmm. So what you need's a sucker. What I need is an ally. And something tells me I shall find none better than you. What do you expect me to do? To start with, join me in paying Von Everick a visit. Then, well, then we shall improvise. I believe, however, that all will end well. And, once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. Right. Specifics now. Thought Holgeard had three wishes, requests, whatever. Uh, he does. He may ask three things of us. Yet, we won't know what they are until we see him. Fine. I'll go see Holgeard with you, but no promises. That is all I ask. You gonna make me do it now? Now remove the damn mark. Naturally. Just as soon as you complete your task. Go. You will not regret it. We shall meet there. I have a matter to attend to along the way. Another debt to collect? Perhaps. Fine. Before I do that... People suck for a second. Even though we're like right here and we can fast travel there. First, oh, that's a question mark now? Well, I'm not fucking bothered by it. We're gonna go to here. We're gonna go talk to our master craftsman for the sword. We're gonna go to Crow's Perch to talk to the woman about Aramur. Because I need better swords. Like, in fucking, like, spectacular fashion, I need new swords. So before we go anywhere, I'm gonna work before I continue with the main story, I am going to go try and fix up armor and weaponry. Talk to him. Greetings, Ivy. Greetings, Geralt. Uh, craft something for me. Listen. All right. Steel sword. Okay, that's oh, fucking forty-five. This is where my issue comes in. Like everything I want to make is, oh yeah, you want the better damage? You gotta fucking become like level fucking ninety thousand bullshit. Um, 
You know, honestly, I can craft this. I can use the steel sword I have now. And I can wait until I'm 37 and use this one. So... These are all my steel swords. Okay, silver swords. The silver swords, 45 damage better. I'm kind of looking at damage for a minute. Whoa! Jesus fucking Christ, that drops a lot. Really? I have no, like, amazing boost in silver weapons. Uh... At this point, I'm honestly thinking of just keeping silver. Honestly, I think I should just, like... I lose 51 armor piercing, and then the year didn't sign and chance to poison goes out today. I can get the chance to poison back easily with a rune. It comes back to the fact being... I realized I had to do something real quick before I make the mistake of not doing it. Um, because I was starting to stream this morning and I forgot to do something. Um, honestly, I I don't see the reason not to craft harpy. Um, I lose out on armor piercing, but it's a silver sword, and then the chance to poison can be put back on with a rune. I'm gonna do it. Alright. You can't... You can't craft my armor, can you? No, you can't. Okay. Um... I don't need this, because it's weaker armor anyway. And I can't use that stuff yet. But I should dismantle Weeper so I can get those runes back. Uh, do I have... I should repair shit. I should repair my equipped weapons. Very well. So long. I'm gonna keep those swords on me. And then I'm gonna run back and I'm gonna run to Crow's Perch. And work on seeing about buying an armor. Because that's another issue we're having. Be gone with you. Wild hunts take you all. It's, it feels kind of weird knowing that I'm almost at like two hours and it's 9 a.m. This honestly also might be kind of a shorter stream uh, for the fact of it's like our first Heart of Stone stream, honestly. And needed to be honestly. I don't I don't see the issue of me worrying that much about. Um, getting too far in, because for now it's this is still like, yeah, and I'm gonna probably not 
I, I might stream like another hour or two. I might make this another four hour Witcher stream, honestly. Be eight parts of Witcher. But for the most part, honestly, there's not a real reason to because I'll have so Get much out. backlog. Good I could... you to come by. What can I do for you? And I'm. Hold on. Kept feeling like I was going to belch. Made. Witcher's armor. But I also kept. It's. It got to the point. It. I'm also probably going to. What is missing? Oh. What does this do? This is 14 up. Three up. Okay. But it, it's to the point where I also have UFW this week, and then Friday I will be doing Blackout Beta. I will have a good chunk of stuff that I honestly might just take the week off to like rest and relax. I'm not sure because I'll have so much like bulk stuff and I might try and because I have to go and do stuff this week anyway. So honestly, okay, craft it. It wouldn't be the worst idea to take a week off and try and fix my sleep schedule. Okay, we're looking for better chest armor. Do we have better gauntlets I can make? No. I have better trousers I can make. I can make these. But I can't use them till 39. Honestly, I can't make better armor. I mean, I can make this really, but it's like a 14. Hmm. Wait a minute. Hold up a sec. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What do I gotta be for that? That's 30? Uh, I might have talked too soon. Where are you again? You are right here. I'm gonna make this. Take. Inventory. Uh, I'll put these boots on, and I'm gonna put that on. I'm dismantle those. Uh, so I'm not gonna throw anything on the board in terms of runes, because next level up, I'm literally just replacing the sword anyway. And it'd be a waste, and I could just sell the sword then without worrying about putting the runes on it. Um. Geralt. Uh. Need you to make me some armor. Um, Need some armor. Uh, I don't know why I did that, but uh. Dismantle. Okay. Well. Take. So, we haven't gotten a change of armor in a while. So this is this is new armor that we have. So that's really good. Uh. Okay. Honestly, yeah. So looking at it right now. There's no real reason for me to worry about uh, anything else. Because like I said, the swords are literally in 1400 XP. Going to change. Oh. 
Alter. Least we have we have better. It's not the it's not that much better, but it's better-ish. All the way up. So I'll take it where I can get it. It's it's a minor increase that I would prefer to use. So that literally means that, like I said, next level up we will. I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the silver sword first. Um, and then I'm gonna put the rest of the runes away. But at the same time, I might buy runes, like the really full-on best possible runes I can. What the hell? Oh, that house is on fire. Well, look who's here. The Witcher with the fits to steal. What's new? Got a growth on your platter there. You catch some kind of a fiery pox? Could say so. Manners burning, you noticed? That? All right. You know how it is. Feast drags home with plenty of dancing, merrymaking, rough play. <laughs> we got a bit carried away, truth be told. Plain to see. Where's old Geard? Damned if I know. Must be somewhere hereabouts. No! Please! I beg you! Shut your trap! <laughs> Let me go! Leave me be! Shut it! <laughs> I ain't with you! Drank with you! Fought beside you! Did you kill me now? I'm one of you! You might have been, but not no more you ain't. What's he guilty of? What the fuck's it to you? Not your concern, mate. Tell you what's gonna happen now. I'll ask again, polite like, if you'll answer just as politely. And if I don't? Then I'll get angry, stop talking, and slaughter you all like swine. So what'll it be? Am I gonna hear why you wanna take his head? Or not. Aren't you a thorny prick up the ass? Ataman said to kill him! Got your answer. Happy? Now piss off. We've work to do. Wait. I know Rogeard wants him dead. Still don't know why, though. Just what the fuck is it? Are you anyhow? Nothing really. Just curious. Cocksucker violated our chivalric code. Just one penalty for that. Death. What is this row? Are you not done with him? My ears wither from the screams. Ah, Geralt. As you've returned, might I assume you've cleared the sewers? Or have you not no! been there? You killed my father! Not I. You lie, Horson! That man killed him. Alone. Unbeknownst to me. Out of fury, for your father refused us hospitality. For this willful violation of the chivalry code, he was summarily executed himself. You have a sword in your chest. Anything else I might do for you? Take her away. <laughs> now, where were we? What the hell? Let me put it this way. You have really five... necessary, that whole show. Ugh. Show now. A man must display some madness from time to time. Helps him feel alive. Dare say you know what I mean. Judging by the mark on your face. Killed the beast in the sewers. Congratulations are in order then. Your reward. 
You're also welcome to take what you wish from the manor house. If anyone's left to charred, that is. Was it a tough fight? I sliced its gut open, and it turned into a man. You know that would happen? Of course he did. He'd never have dragged you into this elsewise. Gauntero did. Come to cast aspersions? No. I've come to collect a debt. You know, you first must... Grant you three requests, by proxy. I present to you my champion, Geralt of Rivia. Not so fast. Haven't agreed to anything yet. But you'll do it. Of that I'm certain. Did you know Olgird was the one to turn the Ophiri prince into a toad? Did he not mention that bit? Well then, allow me to tell it. Quite the gripping story. Olgird once loved a beautiful maiden named Iris. Yet, her parents chose to offer her hand to the crown prince of Ophir. Olgir grew to hate the poor sot. At first, he wished to kill him. Then decided this would be too simple. So, instead, he condemned the prince to a base life and a toad's bloated corpus. Yet he grew bored of watching him suffer and decided to end it. By your hand. Remind me, Odin. Who is to fulfill my last three requests? My assistant, Geralt. Then be gone. I don't wish to look at your face any longer than I must. Come. Where to? The stables. My men are preparing to depart. I gotta pop the question directly. What do I need to do for you? Hmm. Let me think. We're currently without a roof over our heads. Perhaps we should start with that. Bring me the house of Maximilian Bossoni. His house? So surprised. But why? I must live somewhere, mustn't I? What's the meaning of this? Second leave of your senses. You mean to mount a filthy horse? Out of my sight, wretch! Know what Vladimir would do to you if he saw? Aye. Vladimir. My brother. There were times he himself stank like foot wrappings three days old. But his mount always looked fit for a parade. Oh, none rivaled Vladimir at feasting, carousing. Sadly, he's been celebrating less of late. You must find him. And show him the time of his life. My second request. Fine. Seems easy enough. And the third? Complete those two. Then we shall speak of the third. Where will I find him? Once I'm done with those two, where will I find you? I cannot know, as my band has planned some diversions. But let us say at the Alchemy Inn in Oxenfurt. Fine. See you there. The brother shouldn't be too hard. But the house? How am I supposed to bring him a house? Actually, the opposite. I wouldn't worry about the house. The brother will be the tough bit. Why? Olgird's brother. Why do you think he'll be tough? I'm afraid he's dead. Has been for years. Uh, never agreed to necromancy. Necromancy is hardly your only option for reviving a soul. An old fa-